Sources are telling WCCO News that new Vikings quarterback Kirk Cousins will be landing in the Twin Cities tonight. Cousins is expected to sign a three-year, $84 million deal with the Vikings tomorrow. That would make him the highest paid QB in the league. And as Bill Hudson explains, a walk around the team's new Egan training facility will likely help seal the deal. Few people are more excited about the signing of quarterback Kirk Cousins than Dan Redpath. This training camp could be a great couple of weeks for us. Excited not just for what it means to the team's Super Bowl chances, but also his craft beer business. We started uh, the, the uh, process of uh, leasing this space before it was announced. So sometimes it's better to be lucky than good. <laughs> Union 32 Craft House is just a stone's throw from the Vikings' sparkling new Egan training facility. So when training camp opens this summer, Redpath sees fans flooding in. Kirk Cousins can only help. You look at the three Viking quarterbacks that just left, you got a total of 45 million at the different uh, teams that they're with. Uh, it makes it look like the uh, Cousins move was, and it's, gonna, it's absolutely going to improve our team. Other fans think the Cousins signing is the best and biggest move since Brett Favre was paraded into town. You is know, this... all these quarterbacks are coming at a high price right now, so I think you got to put the money down for the quarterback. It's ironic that the lone person we saw walking the training facility was wearing a Packers hat. Yeah, hopefully, uh, you know, they can keep it going. NFC Championship, you know, we got to win next year, but we're getting better. Perhaps it's an omen of the team to beat when the Vikings' new gun comes rolling into town. Bill Hudson, WCCO, 4 News. So with Cousins coming to the Vikings from Washington, last year's star QB Case Keenum is going to Denver. Teddy Bridgewater is expected to sign a one-year deal with the New York Jets. And the other backup QB, Sam Bradford, he's also leaving. He signed a deal with Arizona worth a reported $20 million. Whew, that's a lot of people. Yeah, I was going to say, got all that? There'll be a test later. <laughs> uh, some